All right, so I'm gonna be answering more comments from my videos today. And so uh, the comments I'm gonna be responding to, they come from my video that said, is it moral or ethical uh, for landlords to raise the rent? You know, that, that was a comment video. So it's pretty interesting that people are putting comments on my comment videos where I'm answering other comments. But anyway, uh, this comment is coming from a user and his name is the Agatho Cacological. And uh, I, don't, I don't know if I pronounced that correctly, but he actually left four comments on this video and he wasn't very happy with the things I was saying, but um, let me just read through them really quick. I'm not supporting this after these comments. I'm blocking. I've never sent out a death threat, but I'm ready. We don't have a clue because they don't tell you. Taxes haven't gone up yet, but when they do actually go up, I hope you lose everything. Most people raising rent aren't doing nothing to upgrade. I lived in an apartment for years. Rent go up every year. Same stank apartment. I hope greedy people raise the rent, then lose money with an apartment. I hope and pray. Well, you know, before I go any further, let me just say, please, if you're going to leave a comment, please leave full sentences that, you know, it's, that are easier to understand. I'm trying to get the gist of what you're trying to say here. Looks like you're pretty angry with, you know, my responses to these videos. But, you know, if, unless, if you're leaving these sentence fragments and, you know, uh, leaving out punctuation and such, I'm not going to have a very easy time understanding what you're trying to say. So please work on that. So um, we'll start with the last thing you said, which says most people raising rent aren't doing nothing to upgrade, right? And here's what I say, right? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter if they're not doing anything to upgrade, okay? So you are under the false impression that, hey, in order to raise the rents, I have to, what, come in there and uh, fix your place up and make it nicer? No, no, it doesn't work that way, okay? Simply put, we had a contract in place, which was your lease, that said for, you know, one year or however long that lease is, you can stay in here for X amount of money. Now, if you want to stay for an additional year, well, you might have to pay a little bit more. And there's a reason why that I'm charging a higher rent going into the next year, because all of my expenses have increased, whether I upgraded your unit or not, okay? That means my utilities are higher, my property taxes are higher, okay? My maintenance costs are higher. <laughs> Simply put, I can do absolutely nothing to your property and still end up it costing me more in the next year. That is the way things work, especially when a new landlord comes in and they have a higher cost basis than the previous landlord. If you had watched the video, which I truly doubt that you did, then you would understand that. So th this is one of my big gripes with all these people who are making complaints please watch the video because I actually do explain exactly why we are raising rents in the videos. And it's obvious you didn't read that, but let me keep going here. And it says, I hope greedy people raise the rent, then lose money with an empty apartment. I hope and pray. Well, you think we're raising the rent so high that you know we're gonna outprice the market? That's not the way rent raises and rent increases work. No landlord is doing that. What landlords do is they raise their rents so that it matches what the market is charging. It matches what people are paying, okay? If every other landlord in my town is charging $1,500 a month and I'm charging $1,000 a month for my unit, well, I am you know, able to raise my rents up to that 1500 and I will still have plenty of renters who want to stay in my place, regardless of what you think. You don't understand the market if you don't understand that. And you know, don't tell me that a landlord doesn't have a right to a profit. Don't tell me that a landlord doesn't have a right to increase their uh, rents in order to make a profit or to pay for their, cover their expenses, okay? If you believe that, then you should say that about every single business across the entire world, okay? Be it a place selling food, clothing, or whatever, okay? Do you think that those Nikes that you buy actually cost $150 to make? Because they don't. 
No, Nike probably makes them for like 10 bucks at some factory in a small developing country and then sells them for $150 so they can make as much money as possible. And yeah, everybody needs shoes, but you don't have to buy their shoes, just like you don't have to rent my unit, okay? <laughs> but let me see what else you said in these comments, right? I've never sent out a death threat, but I'm ready. Well, we don't need to go there, okay? This isn't about some, you, you know, you shouldn't be threatening people with their lives. You should just remain calm because this isn't anything personal, okay? We are running a business. Do you go down to the grocery store and threaten them because eggs cost too much right now? No, okay? So get calm, you know, don't do anything crazy because that is ridiculous. And finally, you said in here, I'm not supporting after these comments. I'm blocking. Okay, I'm, I'm good with that, you know? I, I don't know why you watched the video in the first place if you didn't like it so much. I do appreciate you watching it. I appreciate everybody watching. I also appreciate the fact that you left a comment, even if you disagree with me. Because simply put, I like interaction with other people. I like hearing other perspectives, but I'm not gonna back down. I'm not gonna change my mind based on your comment because simply put, it is ridiculous, okay? It's ridiculous. So I hope that answers your question.